All right, hello ladies and gentlemen, it's VMP, welcome back. This time we're here with a little more of a War Sword Conquest. So, last episode, we did some work. We got a lot accomplished. Not only did we make a whole bunch of money, but we got a full suit of Chaos Armor, and this thing is badass. 22 for leg armor, not bad. We got ourselves some gloves, or some gauntlets, finally. But then, Chaos Chosen Armor, 59 and 22, and then the helmet is a 60 Chaos Lord Helm. We are so beastly right now, so massive, so tough, feel really bad for this elven horse that has to uh, carry us around, but we're going to try to change that this episode, um, because this episode we're going to do a little bit of raiding first just to make some more money, never hurts, and then we're going to go down south and visit uh, the orcs, the goblins, the tomb kings, all of them, and see what they're about. So, before we head down there, uh, it'd be nice to make some more money, although we, al we already do have 20 grand on us right now. Uh, but if we can, uh, you know, make, you know, 40,000, get up to 40,000, that way we could buy, you know, potentially three or four different die works down there. Then we'd be making a lot of money every week, every single week. So, that's what we're going to go for. So, let's head over here to Parash. We've generally been pretty lucky when it comes to going over here. There's not generally not too many lords or whatnot. Yep, see, even these defenders of the realm, 69 of them are running away from us. They know they don't stand a chance. All right, let's quick check out Quinnell's, though. And make sure that they don't have, like, a lord here. Oh, they're following us all of a sudden. They have a tiny lord in there. I'm not afraid of them. I don't want him to be able to fight us. Just him. Perfect. Yep, it's only them. Haha, <laughs> divide and conquer. That's how we do it, boys. Alright. Oh, jeez, I forgot how massive we are now with this armor. Like, we can barely even see ourselves. Alright, let's charge in. I'm not afraid of these guys. Not one bit at all. Oh, I just remembered. We still have two more skills to pick up at the arena. Okay, so yeah, it's definitely a good thing that we're trying to get some more money. We're gonna need it. Block that. Get out of there. Alright, we're just gonna go for these people on foot. Often. Oh, shit. Couch lance damage. Ouch, that hurt. How did he... I'm not even sure how he was able to uh, turn around so fast and hit us. That's kind of scary. I mean, he did a bunch of damage to us. So what did on 37, but Iron Flesh soaked a bunch of it. Come on. There we go. Ouch. Alright, who's shooting me in the back? Yeah, I, th I think the main thing we just have to worry about is those lances. The rest of them aren't really doing a lot of damage to us right now. Alright, come here. Damn it, it's kind of hard to aim. We block so much of the screen, it's kind of hard to see. Hmm. Oh, hello, Minotaur. About to go do some work for us? Who is that? Oh, that must be a corn knight. Boom. Hmm, that was not a lot of damage. Yeah, I definitely want to get that power striking uh, skill. That would be very nice. Oh, our skeleton captain died. Damn it. I wanted to level him up into a uh, black knight or whatever. There we go. Come on. Take his horse down at the very least. There we go. Oh, there's another one. Hello. Your friend's still running away like a coward. Can't blame him, though. He doesn't really stand much of a chance. Alright, there we go. Good shot, Corn Chaos Knight. Who's left? Looks like maybe... Two people left on horseback. Alright, one's dead, and then the other one's over... Nope, over here. And there's he's dead, too. Okay, perfect. Yeah, we have such a badass... Oh, there's the Chaos Troll. How massive he is. Jesus. What is this thing? What are you? Vampire Thrall. Holy shit, it looks badass. Our army looks sweet. Awesome. Um, get us... Yeah, look. Hell yeah, we'll take a Tuscore Charger and a Beastman Wargore? Oh, uh, sure, why not? What is a Wargore? Oh, we already have one. Okay. Can't be too bad then. Warriors of Corn. Okay, we've got eight of them now. Alright, those guys are going to start leveling up soon. Very nice. Where is that? Beastman Wargore. Oh, that's it. They're just infantry. Okay, that's still not bad, though. Not even gonna bother looting that stuff. Get out of here. Two chipped swords. We're better than that. Okay, they're afraid of us now. Let's go to Parash. And loot and burn. Very nice. Oh, that cattle herd's still following us. Huh. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I don't think the cattle herds follow us for too long, though. I think what... 
I'm not. I'm still not sure. You guys seem to think that uh, once you go out of range of them, they just stop following you. I'm not sure if it's a time-based thing or a range-based thing. Whatever the case, we're not going to have them following us long term, uh, unless of course they don't despawn. But I have a feeling they despawn if you're just not with them or they're not following you for a long time, because that's what they normally do on the map. But maybe if having them follow you once keeps them around, I don't know. Guess we'll find out later, but. Okay, you got another cattle herd? Which one's accompanying me? This one is. So tell them to follow us too. Uh, drive them onward. Perfect. And actually, hello. Let's get this patrol right here. They have 17 prisoners. Which I would very much enjoy taking and giving to our uh, cattle herds. No? I think they're faster than us. That's not going to work out. Okay. Let's go back to the Glade of Eternal Moonlight. Sell some stuff off. I don't think we got as much loot from that as normal. It didn't feel like a lot. Could be wrong. Still should be worth at least 5 Gs. Which is actually quite a bit of money. Just not as much as normal. Alright, goods, what do you got? Um, where are we selling? Here. Oh, shoot. Okay. I might be wrong. Wow. That was worth a lot more than I thought it was. Oh, no, it's about 5,500. Okay. Boom. There we go. Uh, should we go ahead and get one of these skills from the arena? Alright, let's talk to him. First off, are there tournaments nearby? Because I'd like to win some. Camp of Skulls, Pirate King Fortress is actually should be pretty close, the Pirate King Fortress. Camp of Skulls? That sounds like it should be close. Uh, I'd like to learn some new combat skills. The dodge skill would be nice. Mighty Blow skill is what we want, though. 5,000? Hell yeah. How much is the dodge skill? Um... 6,000. Might as well take it. I don't think the dodge skill is really going to help us much because we don't have much agility or athletics right now. But who knows. Maybe in the future. Uh, okay. Pirate King Fortress. Where's that at? Oh, it's all the way over here. Ugh. I don't think we can get there in time, can we? What about the Camp of Skulls or whatever? Wow, it's really misty right now. Ground Peak. No. Doesn't look like it's anywhere near us. Hmm, that's too bad. I really want to find a tournament. We haven't fought in a single one yet. It's, it's very rare in one of our series. We almost always, in the beginning, fight a ton of tournaments, but we haven't been able to find any yet. Alright, let's head over. We'll go ahead and raid Chambonet. Okay, or not. 243. Yeah, we're going to avoid that. No prisoners either. So definitely not anyone we want to fight with. Um, okay, maybe we can go over here to, uh, Leguille? Is that how you say that? <laughs> I have no idea. Alright. Okay, anything. Quinnell's, is that lord a little bit bigger by now, I, I would guess? 58, okay, still not too afraid of him. That dude, 26, definitely not afraid of him. Alright, we'll burn then. And then, I think after this one, presuming we get a decent amount of money, we should be good to go. Oh, crap. Uh, multiple lords I'm seeing, but they're not going after us. That dude has a lot of prisoners. I'd love it if he came after us. Doesn't seem like he wants to, though. Oh, well. Come on. Finish up. Oh, shit. Okay, he's actually fighting us. Interesting. Alright. Okay. Let's do it. 132 of them. However, most of those are villagers. And... They are on... Oh, God. Cattle's already going down. <laughs> Most of them are on foot. No, all of them are on foot. Well, we do not have that limitation. Oh, yeah. Look at these guys. Look at our Chaos Pit Kings. Oh, man. They look beastly. All right. Wait for them. Wait for them to get a little closer. Then we'll have some fun. All right. This looks good. Charge. Let's go, boys. Boom! 158 damage. Okay, now we're dropping bombs out here. Now we're just... These are knights. These are their best units that we're just dropping with ease. With ease. Come here. Who wants some? Oh, whoops. Just did three damage to me? Big deal. I can take it. I can take it. Alright, stop hurting my horse. Actually, I think we need to get off this horse. It's about to die. The, the poor horse goes through enough. I don't want to put it through any more than we need to. Who shot me? 
Put shield on back. Oh, let's help out this Herald of Corn or whatever. Oh, I forgot this mod is the stupid shield bash thing. Oh, the blood letter died. That's too bad. Ooh, come on. Oh, okay, good move there. Good move there. I'll give him that much. Still going down, though. Still going down. Get off of me, peasants. Let me kill this knight, and then I'll come back to you. Alright, so far I feel like we're doing pretty good. We've lost a few units. I'm not... Oh, shit. Now we're starting to lose some more units. Okay. I'm not too fussed about that, though. We kind of had a big party going. 50 plus, and we're getting a little slow. I wouldn't mind having a bit of a smaller party with just more elite units. Okay, okay, come on. Corn Knight, stop blocking my view. I'm not digging it. Oh, who is this? Who is that? Get out of here. Grail Knight. Grail Knight. This ain't Monty Python, baby. This ain't Monty Python. Who is that? I'm not sure who that is. There's 35 of us left. Come on. Come join us, boys. As much as I enjoy getting all these kills to myself, a little bit of help never hurt anybody. Come here. Come here. Oh, there we go. Boom. That was a Chosen. Oh, that was a Chosen that just died? That's sad. The Chosen are our best units. Eh, arguably the... Hmm, maybe the Corn Knights are better. I don't know. I don't remember. I'd have to look at the troop trees again to see what we're going for exactly. Oh, there's the Chaos Troll. Come on, go off, Chaos Troll. Did he hit him? I don't think he did. Oh, well. There's only a couple left. Wow, this battle. This is a big battle, actually. 132, huh? There we go, victory. That's what I'm talking about. Good job, boys. Look how just goddamn vicious we all look. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How many did we lose? 13? Okay. Could be worse. We beat all of them. Oh, you are my prisoner, bitch. You are my prisoner for sure. Oh, shoot. Now they're going to come fight us. Oh, there we go. But we looted him. That's all that matters. Alright. Very nice. This will actually give us some room in our party to pick up, um... Oh, yep, he's coming after us. He was trying to pretend that he wasn't going for us. I wasn't buying it. Wasn't buying it. Alright, so let's head down here. So, let's head back this way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, not that way. Not that way. Yeah, get out of here. Uh, I guess we could always... Let's go to King's Glade, and then we'll try to go through the mountains somewhere. Cut through there. We might go through Skaven territory. Not sure. Just to avoid any conflict. Do these guys have anything good? 17 prisoners. Um, no, not really. They had a few okay units, but nothing great. Nothing that we're going to go ahead and give chase to them. Uh, tell you what, can we sell this guy? Whoops. What do we do with him? Oh. <laughs> Talking shit to him. All right. I'm good to go. We should actually probably check out a tavern. We haven't done that in a bit. Ooh. There we go. Uh, but first off, let's sell what we have. I should. So we should be back above 20. Oh, yeah. We're going to be well above 20 grand. Oh, man. That was a good one right there. Jeez. Okay, tavern, what do you got for us? Oh, it's this one. I forgot about that. Uh, who's this? Forest Scout. Ransom Broker, uh, Halfling Scout, Chaos Zealot, no, Cult Master. Okay. Ransom Broker. Okay. Uh, any of my companions? Nope, we rescued all of them last time. I, I think, yeah, there's nothing much for us to do there. There's supposedly over 100 heroes in this mod, so it's going to take a while for us to find them all. But, I don't even know if we, we're probably not going to find all of them. But we're looking to get a bunch. Because that's nice. That's an army of people that can't be killed. Do, are we not moving? What's, what's going on here? I want to go here. Or Iron Rock. Iron Rock looks good. 
What is this? Jesus. Skaven army? Okay. Feels like we're moving really slow. I guess it is night. Still, though. Oh. I'd like to raid Bugmans. If we could. Oh, what is this? Ooh, you know what? Screw it. We're going to quick raid Bugmans. Get some revenge. Oh, ninjas. Whoa. 34 ninjas? What? That's a thing? Alright, let's go, boys. <laughs> we're going to save this town and then raid it immediately afterwards. And somehow we're going to get honor for doing that. Yeah, they're actually just straight up ninjas guarding this town. Why are ninjas guarding this town? Why would that ever be a thing? I don't know. Whatever, they're pretty easy to take out. Down they go. Down they go. Uh, you... Oh, oh, come on. Let me take them out. Can we get them? Oh, come on, let me reach him. There we go. We have so much range on this goddamn axe. It's amazing. I think, like, if we were to do another playthrough, I might want to do, like, a dwarf. Because dwarves can still use this weapon. They could use this weapon, but they're small targets. That'd be pretty OP. Small target, but they can use weapons that have, like, range twice as long as their body. I get some honor, and then loot and burn. They're gonna give us a reward? Nah, it's okay. We're gonna take everything you have in a sec here anyways. It's all good. Don't you worry about it. Alright, so we still have this cattle herd following us. The rest of them, not so much. Okay, Dwarven Lord coming. Dwarven Lord coming. Looks like we're good, though. There we go. Alright, he just ignored his town getting plundered and raised. Not complaining, just seems a little odd. There we go. Awesome. Did we level up? No, we did not. We're close, though. Only about 4,000 more experience. Kilgore leveled up. That's what it was. What do you got, baby? 10 strength. We're get, we're working on it. You're going to get there, baby. You're going to get there at some point. Tuscore Charger. Nice. Warrior of Corn. Yep. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Alright, very good. Uh, no cattle herd from them? Oh, there is. Just one. Oh, hello. <laughs> that uh, Hold King was coming for us. We got out of there at the right time. Whoa, okay, hold up. Oh, that, wait a minute. Oh, do we have to pass through here? Oh, I think we do. Okay, that's not good. We'll let him run a little bit. Get ahead of us. Hopefully sit in his town. Where's he going? I do not want to fight that. 182 dwarves? You know, maybe we could beat them, but at the expense of a ton of our troops. Okay. Looks like we're good. Looks like we're good. How is Chaos doing? How are they doing? Okay. Like I said, they didn't lose Ascraved, but they did lose uh, Thorshafen. So, I don't know. We're kind of cutting ties with the Chaos faction. Like, we are of Chaos descent. We are about spreading chaos and play, or, or, <laughs> and plundering and raising, not plazing. Um, but we're going to do it on our own. We don't need their help. We're going to do it by ourselves. Okay. This dude is still following us. Give us a break. All right, let's go to Iron, Iron Rock. Yeah, we'll go to Iron Rock. I think that's the main, the main... Ooh, hello. More dwarves. Jesus, they're all over the place. Are they at war? You would think the dwarves would be at war with the orcs. Could be wrong, though. Could be wrong. What do we got going on over here? Bunch of Skaven and Orc patrols. Alright. Nothing too crazy here. To Iron Rock. What do we got here? Oh yeah, they've got a ton of Dwarven prisoners. they got to be at war. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Another about 8,000 or so. What do they have in terms of weapons? Uh... Meh. It's not bad. Not great, though. Not nearly as good as this thing. Okay. What about on horses? Oh, armored boars. Okay. Can't ride those, though. Guildmaster? Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get some land here. I don't see us being at war with the uh, orcs anytime soon. Direworks? 1684? I'm sure that's going to be the best one. Oh, it's only 8,500, too. I didn't realize that. Oh, wait, tavern. Shoot, let's look at the tavern. Something good. Something good. Oh, wow, this is interesting. Wow, this is really weird. Okay. 
What do we got? What do we got going on over here? Who's this dude? Jagutwa. Oh, we've met him before. Yeah, sure. 100 dinars. Join us. Jagutwa. Why don't we take him before? Oh, I think we're out of party space or something. Alright, here we go. Oh, no. Mercenary. Cult master. No. Whoa. Wow. Okay. It's a little violent. Who's this dude? Mercenary Savage Orc Berserker. And then just a regular human tavern keeper. Okay. Um. Wow, yeah, there actually wasn't too much here. Did get a new hero, though. Uh. Okay. So, again, reminder on the naming of the heroes. Just, if you want a hero named after you, of which there are two right now, Vom and Jigutwa, tell me which one, specifically which one. Don't say, just give me your next hero. No. Tell me the name of the of the hero you want and what name you want him to be called. And the first person to do it gets the hero. It's that simple. It's really not that complicated. I have faith in you guys. I know you can do it. Uh, let's head over here to the Bloodhorn. I really want one of those goblin uh, squigs. I really want a squig. Because that might actually help us in combat too, just because it's smaller, so we won't be riding as high on it. And it might block uh, less of the screen. Not to mention, they're also crazy fast. And pretty durable as well, unlike our current horse. Can you get an armored squig? I really want to see an armored squig. I feel like that'd be funny. Alright, here we go. What is this stuff? Oh, Pirate Kingdom. Okay. Ooh, oh, there's a bunch of Tomb Kings prisoner here. We might have to free them. Just to get some relationship with them. Whoops, nope, not here. Arms, they got anything good? Not really. But they are goblins. They actually have some pretty decent reach for some goblin weapons. 102. <laughs> this is their two-handed weapon, 102 reach. Our one-handed is 120 reach. Makes complete sense. Alright, what do we got? You got a squig for us? No, no no squigs here. Got some wolves that are actually pretty fast. 47. Decent armor, really good maneuver. Good hit points. Mm -hmm, those wolves are... This heavy black wolf is actually... Might be better than our current horse. Hmm. I think that'd be pretty badass to ride a wolf. Alright, we're gonna do that for a little bit. We're, we just have all the horses. Oh, I forgot. Actually, having a bunch of horses in our inventory will speed us up, too. So, that's fine for us to uh, go ahead and pick up a couple. Alright. Here we go. Who do we got? Skeezel. I have no story, really. I've been mocked and ridiculed my whole life. Skeezel is my name. Well, I can see why, if your name is Skeezel. For most of my life, I was weak. Beyond weak, really. But I always wanted to try to be an assassin and be respected by Clan Eshin. I tried to better myself for years in the old world, but I never gave up despite knowing my ability. But no one would really help me, and I was always a laughingstock. Then I came to this part of the world, and Clan Rictus offered me friendship and training to become a storm vermin. My whole life, I only wanted to be Eshin. But it was Rictus who took me as their own. I know I am not strong compared to most, but for the first time in my life I can defend myself and be of service to those I wish to help. Okay. You sound like you have great resolve, and if you are available, you can come into my service. I joined an adventure party before, and it wasn't much use on the battlefield. I promise it will be different this time. My polearm training means I can inflict terrible damage on the enemy, even those great horses they ride. Alright, I'll place you in the thick of the action, Skeezel, so I hope you are right. Thousand gold? Sure. We have some money right now. Might as well buy some uh, cool heroes. Who's this dude? Another mercenary orc. Oh, is that a... What the fuck is that? Like a bear? Yeah, it looks like a bear. Oh, whoops, I don't want to... I don't want him to think that we're staring at him. Nope, stop, no, nope, stop. Calstick, stop looking at him. What the hell is that? <laughs> Tresnor. Okay, another skeleton hero. Welcome aboard. We do need to get an intelligence hero. Do we have one yet? I think we have like one, but they obviously aren't very high yet. Keep staring at me and you, you won't have long to live. Fuck, you noticed us. <laughs> I'm not staring. I'm hiring the best fighters from around the world for my grand campaigns. Grand campaigns usually means lots of battles and lots of bloodshed, which is exactly what I live for. Since I was born, I've desired nothing but to kill and destroy for the gods who favored me with the power of transformation. So successful have I been that I have gained my own followers who fear nothing and will fight savagely to their last breath. You will find them in many taverns you will come across on your grand campaigns. They fight for the gods and for me. 
but if you truly indulge me in relentless conquest, then I may just fight for you. Okay? I could fight for you if I knew you were serious and not just looking to use me for one important mission and then settle down like the others have done. If you do, I will kill you as I killed them. They say that money is a way to tell how serious your employers are, so I will re require a sum which signals your intentions. 8,000? I think this guy's gonna be worth it. 8,000, huh? He's taller than we are! What is this thing? Is that actually, like, just a fucking bear? Did we just hire a talking bear? Sir Barrington? I kinda wanna call him Sir Barrington now. Yeah, we're calling him Sir Barrington. I've decided. Can we change that from here? I've been changing it in the mod files, but maybe we can change that from here. I want to check him out regardless. 77 a week, he better be good. Oh, we can't change it. I didn't realize it was that easy. Sir Barrington. Level 30. 180 health? Holy shit! Look at his weapon proficiencies. 10 iron flesh, 8 power strike? What? What is your equipment? Bear Claw Attack? Oh my Jesus. Strength level 40 to use? This guy's a beast. Oh my, I want to get him some real weapons. What is he normally? Is he a beast man? Oh, he is a beast man of some kind. Holy shit. That is awesome. Sir Barrington. Yes. Hold up, did we have? Oh yeah. We have some fine spice in there. Oh, that was worth a lot of money too. Oh, that's awesome. Alright, I'm happy. I'm real happy now. Okay. Um, where is... Is this a town right here? That is a castle. I want to find the other... This one. This is the other town, I think. I want to find the other goblin town, because I really want a fucking squig. Oh, wait, hold up. Before we go, though. Yeah, there's... Oh, there's just one tomb lord held there. We might as well help him out, though. It is the courteous thing to do. Whoops. Where did we just go? Uh, I feel like we just walked into the wrong place. <laughs> Let me out of here. Oh, we went to the castle. That's what we did. To the streets! What do we... Oh, my Jesus Christ. Okay, let me out of here. Wow, look at this. That is cool. Who is this dude? Guildmaster. Um, actually... Did we get... I don't think we got anything here yet. We might as well. Two! God! Two, over 2,000 a week? We'll make that back in a month. We'll make what we just spent back in a month. Look, cow sticks might be all about slaughter and raising, but, uh, hey, that's easy money right there. Okay, we're gonna have to quick kill him because there's three guards right next to us. Who's in here? All right, I want to speak to him. Oh, come on. I thought you were the boss. And just give, just give me the keys. Just give me the keys. All right, down we go. Let's go. Boom. We're in. All right. Tomb King. It's a pleasure to meet you. Or Tomb Lord, not the Tomb King. I'm coming to get you out of here. Um, you keep well behind me. Stay out of the fighting. Alright, let's do this. Oh, get wrecked. Oh, get wrecked again. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of these little fuckers. Come on. Oh, get hit. I'm trying to block the Tomb King right now. Oh, stay alive, stay alive, Tomb King. I got gotcha. you. Boom, down he goes. Any more? Oh, we did it. Boom. You're free to go, my friend. Bunch of relationships, some honor. We're making friends with these guys. And more just spreading chaos, really. When we free lords like that, that means they're out to go back, raise some more armies, and fight some more. That's all we want. That's all we want. All right, let's go over here to Karak Asgul. Oh, wait, do the goblins hate us now? Oh, shit, they don't like us? How'd they know we did that? How are they actually able to know we did that? Crap, alright, let's get out of here. How fast are they? Faster than us. These guys are not, though. Okay, let's make peace with them. Um, 360? Yeah, shoot, let's do that. Okay, I guess we're not going to be doing that from now on. I didn't think they'd be able to know it was us that broke them out. Oh well, we still got some honor relationship for only 360. No big deal. No big deal. Right, let's head over here, then. Fast forward, boom, making 3,000, soon to be 5,000 a week after that new place we just got goes up. Or maybe even more, because we bought two two places, didn't we? Yeah. We're going to be making a lot of money every single week. That's what we want to see. How much money do we have right now? 
about 10 grand. It's enough to buy some more stuff here. Alright, hopefully squigs aren't that expensive. I wasn't actually thinking about that. 10 grand should be enough, right? Oh, they don't even have a squig. Spirited Black Wolf. Oh, I really want him. <laughs> I really want him. Can't afford him, though. Fuck. Damn it. He's really good, too. Not quite as tough as this one, but way faster. More maneuver. Uh, oh, well. We're looking for a squig anyways. We'll have to find one later. Doesn't look like they're available here. Alright, let's head down to... Uh, actually, hold up. Let's see if we can buy some die works here. Because the last one was really good here in uh, Goblin Territory. 2300 a week! God, we're making a killing out here! Shoot, we're out of money now. Alright, well, let's go back and raid some of these dwarf towns. And then we can probably call it an episode. This was nice. I kind of like this smaller army that we're rolling with, although it's not even that much smaller. We have 43 again. I thought we were smaller than that. Oh wow, these guys are running from us? It means we could easily take them on, but I don't see much gain to that. They don't have any prisoners for us, and there's a lot of them. We're all about battle, but we like, we no. We only like battle when it's a slaughter in our favor, or we have something to gain from it. Alright, so far so good. Let's see what these dwarves are up to. We got a couple towns here. We should get some more inventory management. What have we been spending our skill points on? <laughs> I don't even know. Uh, I don't. Yeah, I don't think it would hurt to spend one or two um, inventory management, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. We're just out here raiding to our heart's content. Loon burn, baby. And then, oh shit, what is this? No, oh, stop, 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 stop. Okay. Oh, we good? They're not fighting us. Oh, he's coming, he's coming. Can we... Boom! Haha, <laughs> we stole it from him. I knew that we were right close to being, having them looted. But he was right on our ass. We did it though. Very nice. Alright, good. Now get me out of here. Lord Slayer Skaldor. Yeah, that does not sound fun. Seven giant slayers, four demon slayers. Yep, nope, not fighting him. Not fighting him. Let's get out of here. Let's go down to Iron Rock. What the hell? What? Oh, I think he's happy. Yeah, he was happy that we fucking just murdered a bunch of people. <laughs> I like this Bjorg guy. I like Sir Barrington. Although it said this Bjorg when we talked to him. We probably have to change the name in the mod files to have that uh, actually happen. But for right now, Sir Barrington looks good. I kind of—I really want to see him in battle. I really want to see him in battle. Oh, oh man. Oh man, these dwarves were rich. Emphasis on were. That's nine grand for us. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What is their armor looking like? Lordly black reinforced uh, gloves? That's way better than what we have. There we go. It's 10 grand for us, though. Looking very good. Very rich. We're making even more every week. Let's head down to the Tomb King territory. See what's going on there. Camry. Tomb Kings are just the skeletons, right? Skeletons and they ride like snakes and stuff, I want to say. I haven't really, we haven't really seen much of them yet. We haven't been this far south. So this should be good. Ooh. Ooh, Zardom of Kislev Caravan. Hello. I almost want to just fight them just out of spite. Hmm. Nah, there's not really much we'd get from that. Oh. Okay, high elf. Oh, can we fight them out in sea? Are there ship battles in this? Because if so, that'd be awesome. I really want to see some ship battles. Alright, to Camry. Not really at war with anybody. Looks like the goblins and the tomb kings are at war with each other. The tomb kings, I think, are winning. Oh, they have a, a goblin prisoner here. We might help them out. Ooh, lordly tomb armor. Not that great, to be honest. Well, I guess necropolis is better. Still not too much, though. Alright, what about their weapons? What are they looking like? Oh, balanced tomb sword. 
Okay, not not too shabby. 100 speed, 110 reach, 38 cutting. That's not a bad weapon right there at all. That is pretty decent. All right. What about their horses? Heavy tomb horse? Nah, yeah, not too shabby. All right, let's go to the tavern. What do you got for us? Oh, it's a generic tavern. Interesting. Okay, mercenary undead pirate, mercenary skeleton archer, screets, and ooh, Azulok. Oh, sweet. It's a cheap hero. Awesome. Join us. Who else do we got? Ransom Broker and Humanitarian. <laughs> I can't believe there's Humanitarians in this. That's still funny. And then Screech, that's another hero. Alright, you guys are going to have a bunch of heroes to name. That'll be fun. Except for Sir Barrington. I'm serious. I'm not changing his name. I like what we what we got there. Alright, and then Die Works. 16, 1700. I'm sure that's it. Boom. There we go. We're going to go ahead and end it off there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed... We made a lot of progress this episode. We made a ton of money. Like, we got, like, four new die works at least. We're going to be making, like, eight grand a week now, at least. We're going to be just rolling in money. Not to mention we got a whole bunch of heroes. Let me... All right, so... Where is... Oh, Bjorg is... I said Sir Barrington. How do I... Hold up. How do I change this? Sir Barrington. I might have to change this. Elsewhere. Yeah, I'm going to have to change that in the mod files. Oh, well. Um, but yeah, so we have Vome to be named, Jagutwa, Skeezel, Tresnor, Azalok, and Screets. So let me know in the comments uh, which hero you want and what you want them to be named. But until then, as always, leave me some comments down below. Let me know what you're thinking about this series and all the rest of the series that we got going on right now. I think the mod that we're going to do to replace the last days of the third age is going to be Anno Domini 1257. Um, but until then, as always, take it easy.